two type of electrode that will be used in the electrolytic cell and three main factor that affect the discharge of ions in electrolysis because only one ion will be choose to be discharged at electrode in electrolysis aqua solution three main component of electrolytic cell battery electrodes and electrolytes each labels of the main component can be right left and right and use straight line to show the components don't use arrow please answer correctly when you ask to write name the presence of cations and anions write formula ion present and state or list the presence of cations and anions in the electrolyte. In the electrolysis, molten lead to bromide using carbon electrode. Oxidation occur at anode. Bromide ion undergo oxidation because it release its electron to form bromine molecules. Bromide ion act as reducing agent. Reduction occur at cathode. Lead to ion undergoes reduction by receive two electron to form lead atom. Lead to ion act as oxidizing agent. In this cell, oxidation occur at anode. Chloride ion undergoes oxidation by release each electron to form chlorine molecule. Chloride ion act as reducing agent. Reduction occur at cathode. Copper to ion from electrolyte undergoes reduction by receive two electrons to form copper atom. Copper to ion act as oxidizing agent. In this electrolytic cell, aqueous solution is used as electrolyte. Copper to sulfate solution with inert electrode. In this cell, oxidation occur at anode. Hydroxide ion undergo oxidation by release its electron to form oxygen molecule and water. Hydroxide ion act as reducing agent. Reduction occur at cathode. Copper to ion from electrolyte undergoes reduction by receive two electron to form copper atom. Copper to ion act as oxidizing agent. This electrolytic cell use aqueous solution as electrolyte copper to sulfate solution with active electrode. The different process occur in this cell compare with electrolytic cell use the same electrolyte copper to sulfate solution but using inert electrode only at anode. In this electrolytic cell, oxidation still occur at anode, but copper metal at anode undergo oxidation by release two electron to form copper to ion. So copper metal act as reducing agent. Reduction still occur at cathode. Copper to ion from electrolyte undergoes reduction by receive two electron to form copper atom. Copper to ion act as oxidizing agent. Oxidation occur at anode. Hydroxide ion undergo oxidation by release its electron to form oxygen molecule and water. Hydroxide ion act as reducing agent. Reduction occur at cathode. Hydrogen ion undergo reduction by receive electron to form hydrogen molecule. Hydrogen ion act as oxidizing agent. This is simple chemical cell. Two different electropositivity of metal must be used as electrode to change chemical energy to electrical energy. The more electropositive metal act as negative terminal, 
and less electroposition metal act as positive terminal. Oxidation occur at negative terminal and reduction occur at positive terminal. In this cell, magnesium is more electropositive than copper in electrochemical series. So magnesium act as negative terminal and copper act as positive terminal. Magnesium metal undergo oxidation. Magnesium atom release two electron to form magnesium ion. So magnesium metal act as reducing agent. Reduction occur at positive terminal. Copper to ion from electrolyte undergo reduction by receive two electron to form copper atom. Copper to ion act as oxidizing agent.